Hello, welcome back to Blue Channel. My name is Dara Jagere once again. I am happy to be here. Now, this is a property uh, that I thought was going to take 30 days to flee. But guess what? We actually did it in 21 days. So, um, if, you, if you started watching from the beginning, You will notice I mentioned 30, 30 a lot. We actually finished in 16, but we cleaned up, touched up everything, took us 21 days. I'm so excited. This is a very, very quick one. This is a three bedroom, uh, two baths. My contractor did a wonderful job. I'm going to walk you around the property, started from the outside, all the upgrades we made. Then at the end, I will probably put in the numbers of everything we did. But you know what? Let me take all the numbers right now. We actually bought it for 177,000, I think. Uh, then we fix it with uh, the 23,000 with all the other uh, uh, miscellaneous. Everything comes to like I think 204,000. So everything is 204,000. We are hoping to put it on the market right here in Dallas. Uh, hopefully, we can get some good numbers. In the next video today, I'll share you know how much we're able to sell it, what the profit is, how my investors are feeling about you know what I'm doing. I know Phil did a great job. So, but thank you so much for watching. Thanks for staying with me. Let me show you around the property. Everything is looking good. But let's just see the upgrade. Tell me what you think. Please like, share, subscribe, share with your friends. Let me know if I'm doing a wonderful job. I'm happy to be doing this. I'm enjoying it. And I like the fact that I'm able to turn something, you know, for what it was. You know, from the bad to the good, making it all new, brand new. So, once again, my wife is not here. I'm getting used to her. Been busy and me handling the camera. So that's, she's actually teaching me how to use the camera. She's very good with the camera and all that stuff. So I'm learning to go solo by myself right now. So that's why you see me standing, just having a good time. All right. So follow me around. Let me show you the property, and I'll let you know what you think. Thank you. Okay. So here we are in the property. This is the front lawn. As you can see, the grass is really cut. The roof has been cleaned out. The front is looking really, really good. Uh, one major change is the fence. We added fence in the beginning. If you scroll back a little bit on the video, you will see that there was no fence when we started this project. So on the left and on the right, we've added fence on the side. That gives us an extra uh, layer of security to the property. You can actually access the property from the uh, fence on the left hand side. So not so much in front. The grass is growing already. It was just cut like three or two days ago, but it's raining right now in, uh, in uh, Dallas. So the, sun, the, the, the grasses are growing very, very, very fast. So let me show you what it looks like on the inside. Um, then we'll go from there. So here is the living room, uh, the area of the house. I like what they've done. We've actually changed the wooden, the floor. We use the vinyl clay on the floor. If you remember, uh, you know, in the episode one, if you just rewind back a little bit, uh, you will see that the floor was mostly rug. And uh, we took out all the carpets. You know, they call it rug or carpet. So we took we took out the we took out the carpets. We changed it to the vinyl clay. There's vinyl clay all over the rooms in the other three bedrooms. So that was what we did, except in the kitchen area. So, but everything is looking good right now. The windows are cleaned out. As you can see, everything up. We changed the light, the bulb. The door was painted. Let me zoom into the door. The door was painted a little bit dark blue, and. Uh, when you're looking from the outside, you can't actually know if the door is there or not because that frame, the door frame, actually is very, it, it covers everything from the uh, outside. So I like what it, it has turned out to be. Let me show you the full view of what the uh, living room is like. So everything is looking good and it's all clean. All the, uh, the color. So we decided to go with uh, the little bit of gray. I think gray is like the in thing right now and the color is really good. Yeah, there might be one or two touch ups that needs to be done by my contractor. I just did the walkthrough with her, so we'll get the little things done. But overall, the property is actually ready to be listed. Uh, let me show you the other view of the living room. Yep, from the inside out. So this is it.
And right there is the master bedroom, which I'm gonna go in right now. So let's go to the master bedroom. Let's see what we have going on there. Okay, so here is the master bedroom. Uh, this house is uh, 1,200 square foot. So it's not all that big, but it's just big enough to contain a family of maybe three, four, five, six, or there about. Yeah, so everything is cleaned out, the fan, the, the ceiling, as you can see, everything is painted gray. We use gray, I told you about the floor already, the vinyl clay. We decided to go with the color that will match with uh, the, you know, go with the vinyl clay that the color is gonna match with the color of the house. So that was what we did. For all the doors and the train, we use white. So white for all the doors and the train. Let me, let me show you what the bathroom looks like. The bathroom was totally cleaned up, and that is me. <laughs> so the bathroom was totally cleaned up. Um, we painted all the wood, uh, all the cabinets gray. We changed out this. We took out the mirror, put a new mirror. We also put a, a, the new lights. Uh, the bathroom was totally real. We changed the bathroom. Uh, you know, uh, had the new tiles. Uh, created some new uh, phone. We also changed the shower, uh, you know, uh, also the bathtub. Yeah, that's what I was, I was looking for. The bathtub is totally new, it was, it was changed. If you notice, you hear a little bit of a sound, that is the water is dripping. So I already told the contractor to come check that. So he's gonna bring the plumber tomorrow. So, and that is definitely costing some money because the dripping, everything adds up when I have to pay the utility bill. So yeah, the toilet was also changed out. That is a brand new uh, toilet sink. And right here we have the closet. So the closet, we clean it out, uh, make sure everything is clean, painted it, changed the flooring to the vinyl clip also, uh, added some light, you know, to make it very, very bright. And also we just uh, cleaned the entire place. So everything is looking good. I think uh, the job we've done in 21 days, 21 days is pretty impressive. Hello, that's me. So let me take you to the other rooms and the, uh, the second bath. All right, so here we are. This is the hallway to the uh, other two bedroom. On the left is the bedroom two. On the right is the bedroom three. Then, no, straight down is the bedroom three. And on the right is actually the restroom. So that's the uh, restroom that both of them share. Like I said, it's a three bedroom, two baths and uh, the room two and room three, they will definitely share the bathroom. So let me show you the bathroom quickly, then we'll go into the other rooms. All right, so if you see my camera shaky a little bit, I'm all doing this by myself, so please bear with me. Mrs. Jagade is not here to help me out, she's busy. So I'm moving and recording at the same time. All right, so here we are in the bathroom. As you can see, everything was cleaned out. You see what we were doing in a few minutes ago, which was three weeks ago when we first started. The bath, the bathtub is changed, the towels, the shower, everything is totally changed out. Um, let me see. And now uh, we have, uh, you know, the wall, the the mirror was changed, the lighting was changed, the sink, everything was totally cleaned out. We painted the uh, cabinet gray as usual with, to align with other ones. Uh, the floor. Remember I said the tile floor that goes from the kitchen to the second bath is the only thing that we did not change out. Everything else is practically changed out. You know, we changed, we added all the uh, knobs for the door and also the rails for the tile right there. The doors, uh, like I said, everything was painted white. So yeah, I like what it came out to be. It's looking good. Little, little touch up that needs to be done uh, by my contractor. I just did the inspection with her today. So she'll come back tomorrow and uh, do all the minor, minor things that need to be fixed. All right, let me show you the, back, the bedroom. Let me show you the bedroom three. So right here, I am in the bedroom three. It's just big enough. It can actually take a king size bed or you can put a queen size bed right there. So we got the, you know, the, the fan. This fan actually needs to be changed because when you hone it, it's kind of like rotating too fast. So we, we are, we are going to change this out tomorrow. Um, yeah, everything else is good. If you remember very well, there was a little bit misa right here in the ceiling on the side. So everything has been cleaned up. Everything is looking good right now. All others have been fixed. And that is the closet for this uh, bedroom. So. I 
as you can see, it's a, not too big of a closet, but big enough to take a sizable uh, family, maybe for the boy or for the girl, wherever you want to live in the area. So, yeah, you guys going to live in this room. We change the light, clean it out, dust it out, uh, make sure the vinyl clay goes all the way in, and uh, we painted it white. So, those are the little updates that we made, you know, on this property. All right, let me show you what it looks like in uh, the other uh, bedroom. Okay, so here we are. This is bedroom two. Actually, that was bedroom three I showed you earlier. This is bedroom two. Bedroom two is almost the same size. Uh, like I said, the house is 1200 square foot out there about. So not so big, but big enough, you know, to take a good family. So, uh, flooring, same thing. Flooring, cleaning, painting, uh, clean out the windows, make sure everything is looking good. Uh, little, little things like uh, you can see the alarm. The cover has been taken out, so almost all the alarms, the covers have been taken out, they were dead. So we just bought a new one and that will be added uh, by the end of tomorrow. So the minor fix will be added tomorrow. You'll probably see that in the after picture I am going to share with you. Alright, so this is it. Same size, just like that one. Just like what we have in uh, bedroom 3. So one important thing that I wanted was the lighting. You can see it's very very bright in there. The light was very dark when we bought it. I like you want to go into your closet, you know, you're not going into like a dark <laughs> into a dark room. So I wanted to make sure that it was good enough. So uh, let me take you to the kitchen. I think that's about it. And straight right there, you go into the bathroom. So bathroom, uh, bedroom two and three, they share the bathroom. Okay. All right. Let me show you the kitchen and the outside, and that will be it for this one. All right. Here we are. This is the kitchen. I like what we have done here. If you look at the video from five minutes ago, you will see that the granite was in there. We changed the granite. We added the cooktop. We added uh, the washer and dryer. We painted uh, the cabinet. We didn't change out the cabinet, just clean it up, paint it, make it gray. The granite cost us a little bit of money. I uh, probably put the total details at the end. I can't remember on top of my head right now. You know, had some nice lighting. We went to, it wasn't like an open concept really. But what we did was, we made sure that the granite overflows out. So that way, if you're in the living room, you can actually be able to uh, sit down from the kitchen, check what is happening in the living room. And that's my dad, by the way. Dad, say hello. Hey. <laughs> All right, thank you, daddy. All right, so dad is around, he's also helping out. Uh, my dad, in case you didn't know, is a building contractor. So back then, in his days. So I'm practically doing the same thing like him right now. And that space is the space for the fridge. Um, I like what it, uh, I like the backsplash. The backsplash actually uh, it matches with the color of the uh, granite. So that is really really good. You see what I'm talking about right there. So I like what we've done right there. And uh, in the other rooms, I have the that right there. The first door on the left. That is where you have the the water tank for the eater, then on the right one is where you have the pantry. Also on the left, you have the laundry room. So let me open it up so you see what it looks like today. All right, so that, there you have it. So uh, as you can see, on the right, this is the pantry. It's a very big pantry. Uh, it's actually big enough to take all your food needs. So, you made it clean, clean it out, make it look good, uh, presentable. The, this is the laundry. So the laundry room, which also has the water heater, as you can see, this is the water heater right here. Then we have some of the things that we, we were, you know, when we close on a house, we leave extra tiles, extra bucket of uh, paint, so that uh, if you need to do your touch up, this is the microwave. The microwave is still here, basically because we are waiting on Home Depot to send us the frame that we are going to install before we put in the microwave. So we have a microwave, we're going to install it, but without a frame, we cannot do that. So I'm waiting on Home Depot. Once Home Depot sends us the frame, we are going to put in the microwave right there. So this house comes with a new microwave, which is very unusual, but I guess we decided to add it. So, um, yeah, I think that's about it for the inside of the house. 
Not so much, just about it very quickly. 21 days. Let me show you the outside and I'll wrap it up. All right, so this is the back of the house. If you remember very well, it's all cleaned out. The grass is growing again. So probably I have to be cutting the grass every few, <laughs> every few weeks before we, uh, we finally close out and sell the property. But yeah, it looks good. I like it. I like the tall trees, you know, around the property. It makes it very fun for kids. And it's well guarded now. There's rails everywhere. Uh, putting the fence on both sides make it very enclosed. So you're not wondering who is coming into your property or not. So that's about it. Um, I like what we've done here and I'm very excited. All right, so that's it. Uh, this is uh, one of our projects uh, uh, in South Dallas. I think it was really good, 21 days, we got it done. Let me know if you like it, let me know if you like what we've done. I'm impressed with the contractor's job. I'm glad I'm working with her and her team. You know, uh, the work has been good. So in the next video, I'll probably just let you know how things go. I'll put, I'll put together all the, all the work that we did, the things that we, uh, that we changed, you know, to bring this property to the standard, the cost, the profit, everything that has to do with the property, okay? So thank you so much for watching, I appreciate it. Uh, stay tuned, uh, please like, share, follow, uh, you know, uh, let your friends know what we're doing and uh, we'll go from there. Thank you so much. Bye, right, you get it. See you next time.